Hi everyone and welcome. In this video, we are going to add ESXi hosts into vCenter Server so that we can manage our ESXi hosts using vCenter Server instead of managing each one of those on their own. I've already got my remote desktop session set up into my infrastructure VM. I also have a session open into my vCenter Server instance. I'm going to start off by going to the Hosts and Clusters view. I'm going to right click on my data center and I'm going to say I want to add a host. Put in the name of the host. We'll do ESXi1 first. And we'll click on Next. It's going to ask me what credentials I want to use to authenticate into the ESXi host. So we're going to use the root account for that. And the associated password. It will ask if we are prepared to accept the default security certificate, which is self-signed from the ESXi host. We'll say yes, that's fine. Don't need to worry about saving that. And we'll go to next. While we're at it, we're going to assign a license because we haven't done that yet. So I'm simply going to select the ESXi license that we configured previously. And we are not going to configure lockdown mode, so we'll leave that at disabled. It is going to be located in the DC data center. We'll click next and finish, and we'll give that a minute until that takes place, and we'll see that our host will have been added in. Okay, we can see that this is now completed. And if I expand on my data center, here's my host. All you need to do to wrap up this part of your lab is add in your second host. And that is a wrap for the video. Hopefully this has been helpful for you and we'll see you next time.